Alright y'all, so Jesse was nice enough to walk back up to the car and get my fishing box, which I just happen to have in the truck. I am going to put a rooster tail on. I don't think y'all have ever seen me pan fish in my entire life, but that's what's going to happen today. Putting on a perch colored watermelon seed rooster tail, and we're gonna go catch fish off of that. Perch. It's a bass. <laughs> That's a bass? Yeah. A Are little, we in the three ponds? It is a little tiny bass. just caught the world's tiniest bass. <laughs> or he could be a giant. What is it? Don't do that. There are a lot of fish here. Yeah! Bird! 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 Hey, he caught something. That's not bigger than a bird. Whoa, he, it's big! Catfish! White bird? White bird? Not. Or white bass. That's awesome. Oh my Wait, god. Are they also called stand bass? Or is that just... You caught a white bass! Kinda. That's awesome. Another good catch. Got one. He got one. Woohoo! White bass. Oh my god. That's why, that's why he sent me up for that. It's a little oh, striper. Bird. That's why he sent me up for that Wait, box. Wait, have you ever caught a striper? A little striper. Fish number seven, right? Switched over to a white spinner bait. I'm just curious to see if there's a little trailer. This might be a little bit harder. You're gonna do a bobber? 
Just do one of those. Just do one what? That's one the of those. Um, one of those jigs. Try to eat that one. Look at that. There's another one. It That's definitely a largey. That is a fat largey. Yeah. Alright y'all, we got the fire started. We're going to let that get nice and hot. And Jesse is going to make some hamburgers. Excited about hamburgers. We got, we got the fire going. That's the important thing. After getting it going, all we got to do is maintain. Alright y'all, look at this. So we got burger, 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 burger. Chicken, chicken, chicken. I'm just about to put that on the grate. Woof! That's hot. Do you want to come from this side or no? Mm. There's less fire on this side. But the handle on this side. Like this? Um, this other, from the back one. Yeah. Oh yeah. There it goes. Alright. Sweet. Alright, we're, we're going to let that cook. cook for like, I don't know, four hours. And then, I'm just kidding. Four hours on low? <laughs> no, we're going to, that's probably going to be like, Maybe 10 minutes to 10 minutes. Yep. Alright y'all, food is done. Everybody's burger is the way that they like it. And we're going to take everything off and um, get it put on a plate. Alright y'all, so Jessie is making... Camp yeah. cones! So she's putting marshmallow in a sugar cone. And, and chocolate. chocolate. Don't forget chocolate. And then you just wrap them... Well, don't do that. But then you just wrap them in foil. And we're going to put them on the fire. And they're kind of like s'mores without the commitment. And that's it. Cool. A camp cone. It's very cool. And you're going to make like 50 more of those. Yeah, we're going to make probably a whole box of them. If you all stop eating the ingredients while making them. We can we'll eat them. all of the ingredients. That's true. I'm going to go finish rigging up for the catfishing. Oh all right. And then we will eat these delicious looking... I'll, I'll bring you one when they're ready. Alright, so there's a little bit of vegetation over here. And I darn near made it to it. That's good. Might be a decent one. Huh? 
It's fighting weird. I don't know if that's a bass. That might be a striper. That's a bass. It's bass. It's not a bad one. It's got um a little it's fins damaged on the back. Alright, one more. Please. There you go. That's good. That's a nice one. Thank you. Alright. There's one. There she goes. Alright, so interestingly enough, it looks like there used to be a road or something that came down here. Look at that. So, it, there might be fish around it. Possibly. Oop. I just bumped something, so that's probably the road. <laughs> oh, oh, yes! Oh, that's, a, that's not a bad bass there. Yes, sir. Oh, shoot. Ah, he took me under the... Dang. He took me up under the... No, 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 no. Ah, me. Dang it. He took me back behind the boat before I could do anything, and it snapped my rod right now. Oh, that's a good bass, but... Damn, I just snapped my rod. Mmm, that sucks. Alright y'all, here's the awesome bass that I just caught. Biggin. There she goes. <gasps> that stinks. Wheel. Looks like I am going to be taking. I'm gonna have to order another one of these Ipon rods because this one's been so good. I'm gonna take my other one. I that thing turned on a dime and came back under my kayak. <sighs> All right, I got some changing to do because I'm gonna change this reel over to my other rod. Man, that stinks. You know what I just thought of? I'm gonna check real quick and just. Yeah, that feels weird. I'm going to check real quick and see if it's like just super shallow right here. I don't think it is. No, it's not. So there's definitely like concrete or something going across there. So I need to go get back on that. I was just curious. I was like, well, maybe I'm just in a really, really, really super shallow area. But now that wind's picking up a little bit. Oh, well, it's still not too bad. Considering that <laughs> here lately I'm used to like three to four foot waves and then an occasional five footer from a boat. Okay, so that road, man, I drifted a long ways. Oh well, that's the first time I've ever done that swap. I swapped out my reels. First time I've ever done it in a kayak. It's not easy. Kind of sucked. There isn't enough room hardly to get the line. Um, up through the eyes of the rod. Okay, so the road, we're coming up on it, I think. Looks like it goes, I'll show you. See how, what I'm talking about? Looks like it comes straight down. So I'm thinking, I mean, obviously I'm not gonna go all the way out there, but if I could catch some more big ones right here, I mean, there's definitely, there are definitely bait fish. I'm seeing fish pop. I know you're probably asking how, but I, I have been seeing fish pop up. And there's a blue heron right there, which means that it's eating something. And it's starting to sprinkle a little bit. Nice thing about the kayak is they don't hear me coming. All right, y'all, it's about to start downpouring. And 
it looks like it might possibly start lightning and thundering. So I am going to head back to camp. We can come figure this place out tomorrow because I have pretty much all day. So I will see y'all in just a little bit because I'm going to show you what I'm about to go get nice and comfy in. All right, y'all, that's it for day one. Um, we ended up with about nine pounds of fish. I am in, it got really windy and, um, really windy and it got choppy on the water, started pouring. It hasn't thundered yet, but I don't know. It looked like it was going to. I am out for the night. I'm going to read some and I really hope y'all enjoyed day one of this, um, trip. And tomorrow's a fresh day and we're going to get out there and day two is going to rock. Hey, good morning, y'all. Okay, this is the current situation. It's raining pretty good. Um, we're still going out there. I'm going to hopefully catch a toad or maybe two, three, I don't know. Anyway, I got the kayak in there and got the poles loaded up. Got to grab some bags and then we'll get out there and fish. It's a bowfin. <laughs> I just got a bowfin. Alright. <laughs> like, yeah, it's a bowfin. It's right off the end of a log there. It's a log. Oh god, I hate these. These things are. mean and they have teeth there he goes <laughs> caught a bowfin on a spinnerbait he didn't thrash it too bad not as bad as that chain picker, the last chain picker I caught. That was bad. Destroyed my spinner bait. I just cast it down there and pulled another one off of the the rock wall. Whatever that wall is right there. It's a good one too. No 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 no. Alright. Man, there's a fighter. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Mother child. Look at that. Look at that. It's a butterball. Eat, eat, eat. See ya, buddy. Alright, y'all, that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I am going to go get some dry clothes on for the drive home. Like I said, it's like two and a half hours. I think it's two hours and 35 minutes or something like that. But anyway, I gotta go. I gotta get home. I have family that misses me. The uh, looks good, doesn't it? Doesn't it look perfect? Anyway, I'm getting out of here. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button down below. If you um, have a comment, which I know you do, comment down below. If you want to share the video out, I would appreciate it. And make sure you subscribe. I will catch you all next time. Take care.